So you're thinking about moving to South Florida. Maybe you've got a couple cities in mind. Boca Raton might be on your list. Well, in this video, I'm gonna share the best things about living in Boca Raton, Florida. So stay tuned. What's up everyone, it's Tanner back again with another video all about sunny South Florida. And if you've been researching where to live here in Southeast Florida, you've probably already heard of Boca Raton, but if by chance you haven't, Boca is only about a 25 minute drive from Fort Lauderdale and has some great things to offer. So if you've been looking into living in Fort Lauderdale, Boca Raton might be an area that you're gonna wanna consider as well. And if this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything there is to know about working, eating, sleeping, playing, and living right here in South Florida, make sure you hit that subscribe button and tap the little bell so you get notified every time I do a new video. All right, so let's get into why you'll wanna live in Boca Raton. And number nine is super important. So if you have kids or you're planning on growing a family down here, make sure you stay for that one because you won't wanna miss it. So the first thing on our list of reasons to live in Boca is gonna be pretty much the same as anywhere else in South Florida. And like I said earlier, you're only about a 25 minute drive from Fort Lauderdale. So you're still gonna get that beautiful, beautiful weather. And although the summers can be pretty hot, the cooler parts of the year from December to March give us an average temperature dropping into the low 60s in the evening. And we wouldn't be called the sunshine state if we didn't get sun all year round, right? So cloudy skies aren't a very frequent thing for most of the year. And for the most part, even on those rainy days, it does doesn't tend to last all day. It might rain for a while, but the sun does eventually come back out. Number two is the food culture. And the nice thing about Boca is it's right in the middle between Fort Lauderdale and West Palm Beach. So you're gonna have tons of options in either direction and at every price point. But the consistent thing is you'll get an enjoyable meal with great service, whether you choose fine dining or just a little burger joint. And because of South Florida's diversity, you'll find it all from Chinese to Italian, Japanese, Greek, seafood, whatever you're in the mood for. Number three on our list is great shopping. And I know most major cities have malls nowadays, but Town Center, Boca's Mall is one of the best. Packed with upscale luxury stores as well as your more routine places to shop, stores like Abercrombie & Fitch, Alex & Ani, Bloomingdale's, Brooks Brothers, Coach, Apple, Brighton, Cole Haan, and Vineyard Vines, just to name a few. And of course, you can't leave out the food, so you have everything from Chick-fil-A all the way up to Capitol Grill. Number four is Boca Raton's small town feel. And if you ask anyone that lives there, it'll be one of their favorite things about the city because Boca Raton has most of the strengths of living in a larger metropolitan city without all the congestion. And to put things into perspective, Boca Raton has a population of under 100,000 people, whereas Fort Lauderdale has nearly 200,000 and Miami has about 470,000 people. Number five are the beaches, and Boca has several miles of beach, both open to the public as well as private beaches, and the city takes great care to ensure that all the beaches and the facilities are clean and safe, and they even have lifeguards on duty from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. year-round, and there's some dog-friendly areas too. Number six is the proximity to the Bahamas. Freeport is only 75 nautical miles west of Boca Raton, making it a super quick and affordable getaway. For number seven, we're talking about the communities. So Boca Raton has this image of being a playground for the wealthy, and a lot of it has to do with the number of luxurious gated neighborhoods. And Forbes magazine reported that three out of the top 10 most expensive gated communities in the entire nation are here in Boca. And Royal Palm Yacht and Country Club is at the top of that list, where currently the cheapest home you can buy is starting at just under $2 million. That brings us to number eight, and like I said, probably the most important thing on this list, especially if you have children or you're planning to have children, because living in Boca gives you access to some of the top rated education in South Florida. So you do have access to quite a few private schools, but if you opt for one of the 13 public schools here in Boca, you'll be in good hands. Eight out of the 13 have a rating of either 10 out of 10 or nine out of 10, and the lowest rated school in Boca is six out of 10. So besides the great selection of preschool through grade 12 schools, Boca Raton is home to four colleges, Florida Atlantic University and Palm Beach State University, which are both public, along with Lynn University and Everglades University, which are both private. And if you want more information about the schools, I'm gonna put a link down in the description, so check that out. And if you're even thinking about moving or relocating here to South Florida, you've gotta give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, message me on Facebook, however you wanna get a hold of me. Make sure you check out some of my other videos, and remember, I've got your back when moving. <laughs> 